So tell me again, what was the word for she and also the word for this, referring to feminine things? Afti. Good. And the word for they, referring to females or feminine things, and also the word for these, referring to feminine things? Aftes. Aftes. Good. The plural of aftos is entirely more interesting. The plural of aftos is afti, but this afti is spelled o-i. So I mentioned that the o-i spelling of the e sound is associated with plurals. We've seen how the e sound, which is used a lot in the grammar now to, to show different things like the verb ending or, or the feminine, is spelled in a different way depending on what it's showing. We saw the feminine e with that N or H shaped letter. We saw the E on the end of the verb, like cani, ftani, telioni, which is like EI. And now the plural E sound, O, I. So the plural of aftos, afti, sounds just like she, but it's spelled differently. If you wanted to say, for example, they are finishing, not us, let's start with they are finishing emphasizing that male or mixed group. Afti telionun. Good. Afti telionun. They're finishing. Afti telionun. Not us. So for not us, we could say no, we. Mm -hmm. You remember the word for no? I mentioned it really briefly. Then. That's the word for no. But the word for no is ohi. 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 Oh, yeah. And the word for we? Emis. Yeah. So how would that be not us? Ohi emis. Good. They're finishing, not us. Afti telionun. Ohi emis. We're still going. Hmm. So this also means we have the main plural pattern for masculine nouns as well. So we can think of a masculine noun that we've come across, like uh, the word for road. How was that? Dromos. Dromos. So how would roads be? Dromi. Dromi. And how is that spelled, that I sound on the end? O I. Good. The roads. First, give me the road. What is the word for the for masculine singular? The road. O dromos. Good. O dromos. Now, the roads is e, e dromi. dromi. Good. <laughs> and how is that e spelled? O I. Good. So, if you say. Huh? Both. Both of them, of course. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, that's where I was going. <laughs> if you were saying these. Roads, mm -hmm. how would that be? Afti i dromi. Good, and of course, all spell O I, O I, O I, all the way down. Afti i dromi. Good, and those roads? Ekini i dromi. Very good. Ekini i dromi. How was I arrive? Ftano. How would you say, when are they arriving? Stressing the word for they. So, when are they arriving? Mm. Pote ftanun afti. Pote ftanun afti. You can just stick afti on the end there, or you could have it at the beginning. Afti pote ftanun. You remember the word for world, like in cosmopolitan, a worldly city? Cosmos. Cosmos. So if you wanted to say worlds, cosmi. Cosmi. Good. Maybe you would use that uh, speaking mm. metaphorically. The word for other, other or another was allo for uh, neuter. Allo. Allo, good. How would you say other worlds? Ali cosmi. Ali cosmi, good. So the masculine plural sounds like the feminine, although it looks different. So aftos becomes afti. And this connection between feminine and plural is seen in many languages. Um, which is quite interesting. In German, you have, for example, Z for they and Z for she. In Arabic, you have plural objects behaving like she. So in different languages, you, you find this connection between plural and feminine. I don't know why it is. Uh, there are various ideas about it. Maybe it's because mm. women create more mm. people. Women are the only people that create more people. <laughs> How would you say he wants, and we're stressing the word for he, Aftos theli. Aftos theli. And they want, stressing the word for they? Afti thelun. Afti thelun. Good. And she was? Afti thelo. 
Afti Feli. Afti Feli, very good. And they want, talking about uh, females. Afti Felun. That would be masculine or mixed, but we want yeah. the feminine. How is the feminine? Aftes Felun. Aftes Felun, very good. So we've seen now the main plural pattern for masculine, feminine, and neuter. We've seen afti to aftes for feminine, aftos to afti for masculine, and for neuter, we also saw the plural afto to afta. Afta. So we have afto to afta, like vlio, vlia, the books, pedi, pedia, the children, uh, house. How might that become? Spiti. Good. So how do you think you would make it plural as it's tospiti? Taspitia. Taspitia. Very good. 